Basically, my job is to facilitate the physicians to get patients on clinical trials. There are patients who are on trials because of Craig, because he got all the details. These trials can sometimes be very complex, difficult for physicians and patients to understand. Access is blocked by many reasons. One of them is understanding. And so if uh, Craig is able to get across to the patient what the issues are, the patient can make a very informed consent whether they wish to participate or not. Many of these trials, I'm um, quite sure that there are some patients alive because Craig put them on trials that resulted in a drug that turned out to be a life-saving drug. And we have several of those trials that have been published so far that Craig definitely was instrumental in getting those patients on, on trial. From my perspective, treating patients well and respecting their thoughts, their needs, and looking after them above and beyond the standard therapy, I treat my patients the same way that I would like to be treated. You have to be able to manipulate the situation to keep the patient happy, informed, and, and going away in a positive state of mind. And to be able to put that all together and still have a smile on your face when you do it, uh, takes a lot of a person. And he exhibits a lot of those qualities. He's also the voice of reason in a lot of the meetings. And that's critical often to somebody who knows the grassroots, uh, who's at the sharp end of the sword, so to speak, to tell you what the right thing to do. That's very helpful often. I'm part of a big team at the Clinical Research Unit, and it's not just me. I can't do my job without our whole department. I think this sort of reaffirms that it is an important thing to do, and that when I go above and beyond to try and make things happen, that somebody notices.